Hello, my name is Ayuke and in this video I built my base inside of a clan's compound. And they didn't like that one bit. Listen men, why you raid us men? Why you get in our compound? It's not your base. It's not you it's not your base. You make the motherland angry and when motherland angry we punish you. Bye. No, I was joking, joking, man. I was joking. <laughs> ah! But this was not an easy task and they would of course try to raid me as soon as they realized what I was trying to do. And they would basically have the best raid base someone can ask for. And so getting down a strong base as quickly as possible was ideal. And for this I would need a lot of metal frags. This was pretty easy, all I did was use a furnace base as my starter base. Yeah. Like I don't just wanna build like a small shitty base in someone's compound. I want to build like my main base in their compound. But to craft the large furnace I would need a level 2 workbench first. I bought a hollow and mp 5 at outpost and then the plan was to just run the underground tunnels for the scrap I needed. Oh my god, I got everything back, yes! No way! I somehow managed to get out of there on top. And from this I got the level 2 workbench I needed. And so with that I could craft and place down the large furnace. I then farmed a few nodes and started cooking all of it throughout the day. And before I knew it I had a box of metal frags. I then needed a lot of components for any items I would need to defend my base, especially gears for garage doors. This was rather simple since I had built my base right next to a tunnel entrance. And so I just ran that a few times throughout the day and I had all the gears and components I would need. I would also need a lot of guns to throw at the clan when they are trying to raid me. And so to collect as many guns as possible I had placed my base in the middle of the map and then just grabbed every single fight I could. The fuck? A compound next to me started decaying.
I got very lucky and I got a C4 from an airdrop and one from running military tunnels. And so, to try and get more guns, I decided to raid one of the people I had been fighting with. I got a few guns from this and my first AK of the wire. Nice. First AK. Also some more explosives that I used to raid another base for even more guns. Let's go! Make him bank! Bro, there's so many people out there. I literally built in the most populated area. Yeah, that was a big little fight. Then after a bit more PvPing, I had all the guns I would ever need for something like this. And so at this point I had all the metal I would need, check. Any components I might need, check. A box of guns to legit throw at anyone trying to break into my base, check. And so with all of that, I was ready to move into the clan's compound. Or at least I thought so. You see, I hadn't actually checked out the compound before this. And all I knew about it was what my friend Owen had told me, which was that a huge group with a giant compound lived right here behind Launchite. And so when I headed over there, I was in for a surprise. Everything looks fine over here. We need to go and check inside, just see what's up. Oh my god, yes! Bro, their place is so unsecure. It's actually crazy. I just want to take a quick look inside. Oh, can I get a bag inside actually? No way he keeps peeking! There was no way for me to look around the compound with all of them in it. And so I had to wait for them to leave their base. <laughs> okay. Still a few people online. <laughs> They're leaving though. I think I can get inside to get, like, take a little look.
Might have to take out those turrets. Could build our base over there. Bro, they've just spammed turrets everywhere. I mean, if we... Hmm. Trying to find a space for a base and... <laughs> it's pretty hard. Yeah, I had really overlooked the fact that there might not be any space for my base inside the compound. I just figured because the compound was so big, of course there would be space for a base inside. But the compound was so packed with TCs and bases, and so I would have to think of a way to work around that. I mean, we could raid that thing, raid one of the TCs, and then we can put down something, I think. Like right there. Because then we would only have to worry about one side too if we put it in a corner. Put the base in a corner but then we would have to farm up enough sulfur first to raid that like foundation wipe that completely and so yeah the plan was to farm up enough rockets and just level this base might be a bit much but it was the best i could come up with and it was only a honeycomb one by one so it wasn't really that expensive i have a plan now but we need uh, a few rockets i'd say like 12 rockets Oh, we have some we have some farming to do and so i got to work i still didn't have a level 3 workbench and so i headed down into the train tunnels to get enough scrap for that nice with this I had enough scrap for the workbench and all I needed to do from here was hit a few sulfur nodes, smelt that and a few hours later I had the rockets I would need to get rid of the space. But first I headed over to the base to check out how they were doing. Okay. So that's the base. Should, shouldn't be too difficult. As long as the foundation on that base isn't armored, I'll be fine. But I honestly I don't think they're that smart. Still online. man okay there's multiple of them online it became clear that there was no way that i could do this while they were still online i would have to wait until they were offline if i wanted even the slightest chance to get up the base now i'm pretty sure we're not gonna get raided so here is to hoping. Yeah, so it was about 6 in the morning right now and they weren't logging off anytime soon. And I really needed to get some sleep. And not going for it right there with them online was probably the best thing I could have done. Because you see, while I was sleeping, this base that I had to get rid of decayed. Wait, did it decay? No way. If it actually decayed, um, this video is scripted. It actually decayed. No way. Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We can do it. We don't even need more. We don't even need more rockets. I knew I, I, it was a good idea to wait. Like, I was just gonna check out the base and, like, see what they have done to it, and it actually decayed. This was a huge deal. Now I didn't have to use a bunch of rockets just to get rid of a base. And so I grabbed some stuff for a base and headed over there. Okay, I'm not sure if they're online or not, but I'm gonna try to set up a base inside. The shit is still decayed. And I think there's enough room for me to set up a base.
I have my own Discord server where you can find a playlist with some of the songs I use in my videos. Here you can also find the bass I used in this video, and you can find people or groups to play Rust with. Or if you just have any questions, I'm very active over there too. So I now had a small base inside of the compound. Okay. Base secured. And so now with that, I decided to take a quick look around the compound. Look. What the? He knows, no way he knows. No way man, I've been so good. They felt so safe in their compound. These guys didn't even care about leaving their doors open. And even though I blew this chance, I had a feeling I would get one more. But this drew some attention to myself and just minutes after this encounter, they found my base and raided it. Fuck, man! Now they're gonna place a base or something there. Fuck's sake. Oh. Wasn't quick enough. Shouldn't have fucked with them after I put down the base. Should have just waited. And so yeah, I had gotten myself raided. It was unfortunate, but not actually that big of a deal. I now had a base in the compound. Yes, it wasn't actually mine at this moment, but I could just raid it back later on. And this time I would be smart and wait till they're offline. But as we wait, let's mess with them a bit more. I headed back with some ladders to check out the base I almost went deep on before for all that sulfur. That was close. Ooh. Let's go. Yeah, they would not be happy about this. And just minutes after this, I found them roaming around my area. No, 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 they can't find out my base. They can't find out my, my, where my base is. This was not good. If they found out I lived here, I could kiss my base and all my preparation goodbye. Luckily, they never found out that I lived there. Cause yeah, it would suck getting raided right now.
Anyways, I spent the next hours on the server just AFK waiting for the compound to log off. But while I was away from my computer, I didn't notice the hacker running around my area. Stop sleeping, man! Hello, stop sleeping! And so, when I eventually came back and saw that the compound group had logged off, someone's offline. I grabbed all the items and resources I would need to take back and fortify the base. Not knowing that a hacker had his eyes on my base. Okay. Let's do this. And as I was running over to the compound, I started hearing explosions coming from my base. Oh my god. I quickly spawned in the base I'd raided earlier. I had put an extra kit in there for a situation just like this. It's a hacker, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Wrong. Well. Yeah, it sucked. It really just sucked. But there was a silver lining. Even though I just lost my entire base and all that loot inside, I was super lucky in my opinion. I had still managed to run away with all the resources and explosives I would need to take back and start building on the base. And if I had just waited in my base for a minute longer, I would have lost everything. That couldn't be a better time, like, I know we just lost a lot and we just lost the base, but we can start building on this base now. Hmm. That sucks. <laughs> that is, uh, like, there's no way to put it, it's, it just sucks. And so I headed back to get my body and then I finally started building on the base. Well, I got out of there just in time, I would say. I destroyed one of the TCs that were blocking me from expanding the base, and then it was just for me to start building. Then it was time to start filling this base up with loot. What the fuck, man?
I realized that there were still two TCs that were blocking me from building the whole base. And I tried farming as quickly as possible, and I managed to get enough to get rid of one of the TCs. But this didn't really do much for the base and it still was basically just the core and no peaks. I did add bedrooms to the outer wall with some kits, but this was still not ideal for our defense and I really needed to get rid of one more TCs. And so as I was waiting for the sulfur to smelt, a compound's gate decayed and I decided to take a look inside. It had some pretty good stuff inside. What the fuck? But before I could do anything else, people in the compound started to log on. And they were quick to notice that a new base had popped up inside of their compound overnight. Hey, they're, they're online now. What the... Holy mist! <laughs> oh, they're getting back up. That's people getting shot they don't have off. I mean, th there's a few of them online right now. Like, there's at least two on roof, and then I think it's two that keeps going around my ba- Jesus fucking Christ. Bro, if I didn't get raided by that hacker, this would have been so easy. I would have had the base up and everything. Like, I would have had a full main base up. Full everything. I would have had turrets on this shit. I would have had bolts to use to shoot the snipers. Like, every- everything. Well, I think I've done pretty good, like, considering. However this goes, I mean, I'm not done. If, if I get raided now, it's not gonna be over. But it, it's gonna suck if I lose this base now. Listen, men. Why you raid us, men? Why you get in our compound? <laughs> what you are doing is very, very wrong, men. It is... It, 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 there is... There is nothing civil about this. <laughs> You make the motherland angry, and when motherland angry, we punish you. We have to cut off your water. My base. It's not your base. It's not you. It's not your base. My compound. How? How is the? I live here it's now. It's not your compound. I live here now. Pashul Nakhwe. How is this your base? How? How is this your base? My TC. There, there was base here. Why you do this? No base here. Base, base, base DK. I build my base here. Your mother built the base here. Earlier you make small base. I read. Why you make another one? You are not welcome here, man. Check I live here out, now. Please. I live here now. You, you do not live here. I do live here. You are like red. <laughs> Motherfucker. Why you not speaking anymore, man? And as a few more people logged in, it didn't look too good for me. And it was time to try and somehow defend this scuffed base.
Is that a real rocket? Sounded fake. Cut off your water. Maybe something else. many of them. How many rockets was that? Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Well, that's a GG on try one. <laughs> I mean, as soon as, like, as soon as I got raided by the hacker, like, it was over. Like, there was nothing I could do. I was so prepared for everything. I had the sulfur, I had the boom, I had the resources, I had the guns. I had absolutely everything to build an insane base. Raid everything, build, like, the main base. But instead, I have to defend from a fucking shitty, unfinished, trash, garbage base. Well, it was a good, it was a good try one. Oh. Yeah, this round was over. But I was not finished yet. I at least wanted to get up the full base so that I had a chance to defend at least. But for now, I let them have their way with my base and I went to get some sleep. When I woke up the next day, I headed over to check out the damage. What the? Oh shit. Well, I didn't get everything. Well, it took like nothing. Okay. If we can just raid through this, I think we can take back the base. The grief into the base was minimal, and so it really wouldn't be too hard to retake. Also, while checking around the compound, I noticed that the biggest base, their main base, had gotten raided and griefed while I was asleep. But it was time to farm up and take back my base again. I ran tunnels for components. I also found an airdrop with an LR. Oh, Nice. I recycled all of the components and then I set up a base right next to the Arctic Research Base. I ran this for a bit, collecting most of the components I would need. Nice. I then did some farming. I bought a level 2 workbench at outpost. I still didn't have many guns at this point, but then when I heard a raid close by, I headed over to check it out. I couldn't find a good way in, and so I just waited for the raider to leave. Yo, GG, GG. It's fucking wild. Head shot four times. Yikes.
Yes, we have guns. All the guns we'll need. I headed back to the raid for any leftovers. Now all I need to take back the base was sulfur and a level 3 workbench to craft explosives. I first set it out and formed the sulfur. As I was out farming I saw the kid compound, and so after depoting I headed over to check it out. Yes, a tier 3. <laughs> exactly what we needed. Yes. With this level 3 workbench, we now had everything we would need. Okay, let's go and check out their base. See if they're online or not. Because if they're online, it's gonna be hard. But I think I can do it still. The only thing I'm hoping for here that they haven't done is grief my base even more. Because then I would have to farm even more sulfur. And that's just not gonna be fun. But hopefully they're not online anymore. But I think this will be my last chance to do anything. Because I think after this, if they raid me, they're gonna grief it completely. Like, full on grief it. But hopefully it's just 3 C4s to ungrief my base, and then 2 C4s to take out another TC, and then we can build the entire base. We are still good. Okay, we have the C4s. Well, let's run over there and do this thing. Oh, they didn't even fucking lock the TC. What? Oh, okay, we have it. <laughs> and so yeah, I now had a fully built main base inside of the compound. Okay. <laughs> We're back in the compound. It's like we never left. They're gonna be so confused when they wake up. I also built a scuffed entrance into the compound. Hey, we have a way in and out now, so we can go as we please. Now we truly live here, and we can, like we can go out, we can do whatever we want. We're not stuck in there. <laughs> I did some finishing touches to the base, and I put a turret on the roof. Then the compound woke up, and I could only imagine how confusing this must have been for them. Jesus! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> I thought there was like one of them. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh fuck, that's... <laughs> they're shooting high velocity rockets and they're missing. Oh, they're missing! Oh, that's it. There's so many of them. <laughs> yeah, that's a rip on that turret. That's gonna be gone. There's like eight of them on right now, and they're not even coming to raid. They're probably gonna raid this from their base. But fuck it, it's gonna be fun. I don't care if I lose. Like, this is just fun. The fuck? <laughs> These guys did. <laughs> what the? After over an hour of back and forth, it was finally time for the raid. Here they come. <laughs> Come on. Put it out of the peaks. I need to take peaks. I need to take peaks.
Und TC is gone away. Fuck, that was my chance too. I killed so many. I killed like fucking 15. Nah, now they're just placing a new TC and they're gonna leave. <laughs> they keep dying to the shotgun traps. I mean, the base is lost now. Now we're just playing for fun. No way, man. <laughs> No, they're up here. What the fuck? Hello. Hello. Uh, are you English? Yes. No, 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 I don't. I'll drink. I just want to talk to you. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I just okay, want okay. to talk to you. What do you want to talk to you? Are you okay? No. GG, we've, we've given up, you win. I mean, you have the base, so we'll cut a, a draw. 
Sorry, I mean, what was uh, that? Yeah, sure, we call it a draw. <laughs> okay. Hey, bro, you won. Well, we should draw, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> GG's. It was fun. Can I... You are okay, aren't you? I can tell by your voice. What do you mean? You are. Uh, you're, a, you're a sick YouTuber. I saw you on... I, I saw the map last wipe on Small 3 where you wouldn't launch that. Like, uh, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, sorry for... I, I mean, yeah. you were the only <laughs> compound where I could do this. So... I wanted to build a base inside of a clan yeah, compound. Yeah, that's fine. It was, it was fun. Yeah, yeah, it was quite fun. And yeah, they never came back. Now I didn't own this space anymore and so I logged off too. GG's to this group, it was a lot of fun. And so please be respectful in the comments. At the end of the day, it's just for fun. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then make sure that you subscribe. Also, go and follow me over on Twitter, join my Discord server, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace and goodbye.